how did the filmmakers approach you about making the story? Uh huh. This is quite a long story. I'll try to make it short. Um, I I was on a radio program. Um, I was hesitating to go or not. They asked me to go for a short interview, but I finally decided, okay, I'll do that. And the short five minutes interview became almost an hour interview. And somebody, I think it's Belen, the producer, heard the, the interview and they, they just reached me and told me, okay, we've, we've heard your story and we would like to, to maybe to do a film about the story. And I thought, this is a crazy idea, but uh, I think a wonderful idea, maybe. Why was it important for you to tell the story? Why? Mm -hmm. Wow, this is such a difficult <laughs> question. Why? <sighs> Why? Mm. The main reason, there, there are maybe two main reasons why it was important for me. Um, I'm a very shy person, so I wouldn't like to, to, to tell the story. But I thought it was a bit selfish to keep it for myself, because what I've been living during the whole time there in the tsunami, I thought it was very universal. I mean, it was everything that happened there touched very deep feelings, very deep uh, emotions that belongs to the humanity in, in tough moments. So I thought it was kind of a metaphor of what is living about. This is, I thought, it's important to tell the story, not of, be of because the story, but what it happens there, it's, it talks about the, um, our nature as a human being. And the other important reason was because, I don't know, but maybe there are people who are not able to tell the story, who would like to be, to be there, say, okay, that, that is what happened to us. So that's why I told the story. Okay. Um, what was it like to revisit many of the locations? Because I know, I know you guys shot in a lot of the same locations that you were vacationing in and in the hospital. Mm -hmm. What was that like for you? Very emotional, very deep, very, 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 very touching. And at the same time, very calm, very calm. People were afraid of, of us coming back there. They were almost the whole time asking, are you okay, are you okay? Yeah, of course we are okay. Um, sometimes very, very painful. For, not for us, of course, not for us, but for what happened there. Mm -hmm. right. um, you talked a little bit in the past about it rained a lot during production. Um, did you feel that was a sign or I, I've heard you talk kind of beautifully about what that was. Tell us a little bit about that. Yeah. Um, it was supposed to be dry season in, in Thailand when, when, when the whole shooting was, mm -hmm. was going on. And, and everybody in the, in the um, equipo, oh, in the, um, I got to start, the whole people who is working for the film, what's called? The crew. The crew. Mm -hmm. The whole crew was getting crazy about the difficult situation and they were like looking at the sky every day and saying, no, it can't happen, it can't happen. And I told the director, it should be like this. I mean, there, I could really, really feel how many, many, many souls were, were just dripping their pain and, and just crying. It wasn't rain. It was, it was relieving the pain. That's, I mean, that's what I feel really, really deeply inside. Of course, it was very difficult for the shooting, but um, you can see they manage perfectly. Mm -hmm. Nobody would say it was, it was really, really raining every day. Okay. What do you think, um, what do you think will make audiences respond to this story? And, when, and I'll tell you what I'm looking for here just a little uh -huh. bit, is for you to talk about kind of the, the universality and the human nature, mm -hmm. you know, of like people kind of connecting with their own personal stories, even though they may not have been there. Uh huh. Um, you know, what do you what do you think about this movie? People will connect with. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, I'm, I don't know, but um, if something happens to anyone watching the movie, mm -hmm. uh, I am sure. I'm absolutely sure it's not it's not because this is someone else's story. When you, when you 
feel emotion and uh, for anything you see in the you see you hear is because it's something inside you so if you get emotional with um, a big wave coming and struggling for life um, and you've never been there is because you recognize you've been there sometimes or you will you will this is what it's life about it's um, one wave after another wave and you're struggling to go on. This is um, another beautiful metaphor of the, of the film. Um, if you survive, you can tell the story, you can go on. Mm -hmm. If you don't survive, that's it. And this is for the, sur the survivors and the people who did not survive. Yeah.